kill. Yeah, um, to the issue of the Russia probe, I'm wondering, Sean, if you can tell us when the president knew, whether the president knew at the time that Jared Kushner was seeking to establish back-channel communications at the Russian embassy to the Russian government. And if he didn't know at the time, when did he find out? I think that assumes a lot, and I, I would just say that Mr. Kushner's attorney has said that uh, Mr. Kushner has volunteered to share with Congress what he knows about these meetings, and he will do the same if he's contacted in or in connected with any other inquiry. Did the President discuss it, though? I, I'm not going to get into what the President did or did not discuss, but it, it, what, what your question assumes is a lot of facts that are not substantiated by anything but um, anonymous uh, sources that are so far being leaked out. Does he approve of that action? I, I, you're, you're asking if he approves of an action that is not a confirmed action. That being said, I think Secretary Kelly and General McMaster have both discussed uh, that in general terms, uh, back channels are an appropriate part of diplomacy. So does the White House dispute that that happened? I'm not going to get into it, but, but your question presupposes facts that have not been confirmed. Thank you, Sean. That the President retweeted this morning an article about that back channel that was based on an anonymous source that said that there was an effort to set up a back channel, that it was the Russians who suggested that, and that it was to talk about Syria. Was the president not confirming that that effort, that there was an effort in the facts that I just said? I think what I just that? said speaks for itself. But, but he was, but you said that the, first of all, that the article was based on anonymous sources. Which it is. But the Fox article that the president retweeted was also based on anonymous sources. Why are those sources, or the source rather, that they used more credible than the ones in the Washington Post article? Again, I don't, I don't think there's two issues at hand. One is um, the statement that Jared's attorney has provided. Uh, second is is whether or not the, the, back the, the dossier that is largely the basis of this was largely discredited in the first place. Uh, most, most of the publications here refused to even publish it in the first place. Uh, so again, I'm not going to get into confirming stuff. There's an ongoing investigation. John